Good morning, guys. First coffee of the day. Amazing. Waking up a little bit. We're actually sitting at breakfast right now. This is the view. It's still a little cloudy today. I don't know, but it's pretty. Wait, look the other way. There's mom. That's breakfast. Grabbing breakfast right now, then we're headed back to the room packing up, and then it's off on a little surprise and mom doesn't know about yet. It's gonna be fun. I think today is gonna be cool. And then tonight, I'm really excited that the hotel we're staying at is a private lodge and it looks insane and the commons were insane. So I'm really excited. Hopped in the car and are headed to Light River Canyon. Unfortunately, the whole helicopter thing did not work out because it's been pretty cloudy and the weather hasn't been great and apparently on the mountain especially it was supposed to be a two hour flight so apparently where we're gonna go the, the weather was not gonna be any better anyway so now we're driving to Black River Canyon which we had planned regardless in the afternoon and are going to walk around and enjoy the drive there because I think it's gonna be really pretty. Come on guys, what are you doing? Oh, are you gonna go or no? Alright, I'm gonna... Oh, the little ones! Oh. Yeah, okay, you go first. That's fine. You go first, yeah, you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, bye guys. <laughs> After several detours, we're now only like 10-15 minutes away from where we want to go, so I'm really excited to show you guys that. But in the meantime, we're grabbing pancakes here and they actually have gluten-free pancakes which I'm very excited about and then we're gonna go off to the canyon in just a little bit. She's looking guilty because she took my cream off before I even got to it. Chocolate chip pancakes with peanut butter and bananas in there and then I also got a tuna salad because why not? And then I don't know if this is gluten-free or no. I asked her and she she laughed and walked away. <laughs> Google Maps is doing to us. <laughs> this is actually the, the easy part. It's looking really easy right now. But it changed it changed our route. I actually missed the turn because I didn't believe that that was a street that it was taking us on. We went from a legit highway straight onto the street. It's okay, mom. We're good. Yeah, it's alright. It's a rental car. <laughs> we can do that. Okay, now we're... <laughs> this is pretty freaking cool, if you ask me. <laughs> Here's what we got. <laughs> it's legit. I'm pretty sure I had better roads when I was ATVing in Australia. Scheiße. Alright, there we go. There we go. We got this. This is like extreme sports right here. <laughs> it probably doesn't even look that bad in the video. That's the worst part. There we go. See, we got this one. We're good. Supposed to turn left Langsam. somewhere. So my mom is losing, losing all of her patience. But it's really pretty. Look, we found a little river. It's very nice. Yeah. Look out here. Yeah. Super beautiful. Huh? This is so pretty. My mom can still not relax, but it's gotten a lot easier. I think we're halfway through. Nope. Wrong again. <laughs> and we went all the way to the end. We're supposed to have made a turn here. But there's no no way. There's just, just a fence. So Google Maps kind of tricked us and we had a little adventure. And my mom could not be any unhappier about this. <laughs> just almost died. We, there's one one simple crossing here. It says it says right there there's a train coming. And I'm like, yeah, right. Like there's ever going to be a train coming and there it is. Talking at us. And I'm like, "Oh my god. That's insane." What? That's insane. <laughs> Finally made it. We left five hours ago. It's supposed to take us two and a half to get here, and now it's five hours ago. Um, but with that said, we're now approaching God's window, which is what the place is called. And I got my camera with me, I got my tripod with me, and I think it's gonna make for some cool photos. Mom is in the background walking there, hiding behind shades and cap. Team Birkenstock, yay! Getting closer to the end of the path, I think.
Well, that was the view up there. And that was definitely the end of this way. But that's still not exactly what we're looking for. And I must admit, today, with a little bit more planning on my end, entirely my bad, we probably could have been a little bit more efficient with our time and drive around a little less and walk around a little less. But we just walked into a tour guide and showed him a photo of where we wanted to go because I, am I well, there's one classic photo that you can get here at Blood River Canyon. And we wanted to go see that. So now we at least kind of know where it is. So it's back into the car and then keep driving and then hope we find it this time around. And we finally actually found it. Check out the view. along there a little bit and see what it looks like if we go on that side. Match it a little bit farther forward. How sick is this, guys? One more time, starting with the Birkenstocks. <laughs> what? What's going on? This is called three rondevels, so this is because there's three round rocks right there. So those are the rondevels, if you will. And that's Blyde River Canyon, guys. If you're ever down in South Africa. Definitely recommend you stop by. After that amazing view, we hopped back into the car. We stopped by the supermarket really quick and got some stuff. And now mom is cooking. Thank you. Uh, we're at Elephant Point um, in a lodge. And this lodge is insane. It's, if I say insane, I don't know. You, I've, I've shown you quite a few really sick things. And like, I love my apartment in New York. This is insane. I'm not going to show you right now because the sun is down and it's really dark and you need to see this beauty tomorrow and hopefully we can see some wildlife. I'm talking legit wildlife, not like a cat or a dog running around. Legit wildlife because we're right by the border of Gru uh, Kruger Park now. So I'm hoping to show you the place in the morning and for tonight, mom is cooking up something healthy and delicious. So I want to say goodbye to you. Thank you so much for following along. I hope you guys enjoyed the day and enjoyed the view and I will see you tomorrow with an insane home tour. I can already promise you that. Good night guys.